Al is back, and what have you got for us this week? John, we have a classic Massey Harris for you today. This 333 was built in 1956 and was a childhood favorite for our next collector. And as a child, he spotted one on the cover of a magazine. And, well, the rest is history. It's a 1956 Massey Harris 333 gas. Uh, I bought it from the original owner down in Cisna Park, uh, Rankin area. It was sold brand new in November of 1955 by Goodman uh, Equipment Company in Rankin. They made them in 1956 and in 1957 until end of production in 1958 when they started with the Massey Ferguson and dropped the Harris name off of the line. Uh, approximately 2,500 or so, 2,600 Massey Harris 333s were produced. It has uh, power steering. It's driven off the live hydraulics of the tractor. It's got a 10-speed transmission, uh, which is a little, little odd for its day. And the, the biggest unique feature about them was the engine was bronze. And a lot of people don't realize it, but they have a screen in the front of the tractor. And in the front of the tractor, that was also painted bronze. Sometimes you see them painted yellow, but that's not right. Well, when I was a little kid, I bought a book from a local store with a gift certificate I got from when, uh, my birthday. And there was a Massey Harris 333 on the cover. And I remember telling my dad that someday I'll own a 333. And I just kind of accidentally stumbled on this one. I called a friend of mine and he knew where there was one sitting and he kind of got the deal worked up and I told him don't move, I'll buy it right then and there and I bought it there and I went down the next weekend and picked it up. And I think I'm going to leave the tractor just as it is. Uh, the guy I bought it off of, uh, he kind of wanted it to stay original and didn't want it to go to a guy who was going to tear it up. He had a lot of sentimental value for the tractor. So it's just a few fixes here and there and other than that I think it's, it's going to be pretty much the way it is. And from our Facebook page, we have this 1956 Minneapolis Moline 445 that was restored and won first place at the Iowa State Fair last year. Alex Bozeman said the restoration work and the looks of this picture, he did a great job. Now this tractor was his grandfather's first tractor and was submitted by Sandra Miller. Thanks for sharing this classic Moline. Don't forget, you can find Tractor Tales online at usfarmreport.com or on Facebook. The segments can also be downloaded as podcasts from iTunes.